Mix in the cheese and the chowder with some jambalaya. It's a New Blood Super Bowl, the 31st installment of the Ultimate Game, and the first in five years not to involve the Cowboys or 49ers. And good evening to you. 30 years ago, Vince Lombardi took his Green Bay Packers to Santa Barbara to train before Super Bowl I, where they beat Kansas City. Then they waxed Oakland in Soup 2. Green Bay became title town. Lombardi became a legend. And the Packers didn't return to the big game until now. How big a legend, you ask? Well, you win the Lombardi Trophy if you're the Super Bowl champs. So, Packers and Patriots, nighttime in the city of New Orleans. I, I think I see a lyric in there somewhere. Sing along, guys. Quarterbacks, Drew Bledsoe and Brett Favre. So we'll pick it up on Favre's first offensive series. The home run ball to Andre Risen. Claimed off waivers at midseason. He claims the first Super Bowl touchdown. It's 7-0 Green Guys. Green Bay up 10 until Bledsoe drops back and rips one to Keith Byers. It's only 10-7. And the Patriots get back with the ball and with Bledsoe. And the rainbow to Terry Glenn. The rookie runs under it and grabs it at the five. Watch the beautiful catch. And the guys in white are in business once again. They would take the lead on this play. Bledsoe rolling and finding Ben Coates in the only place he could. The diving rolling grab, 14-10 New England. But once again, the Packers scored quickly. This time, historically, Favre to Antonio Freeman. The longest scoring pass in Super Bowl history. 81 yards, 17-14 Green Bay. 20-14 to 14 before the half, Favre rolling out and saying, all right, you go over there and I'll fake it to you. Yeah, easy. Just inside the pylon, the zebra says that's a touchdown. Barely 27-14 at the half. Late third quarter, Curtis Martin of New England is in the end zone. There's a flag on the play, but it's on Green Bay. So it's 27-21 to 21 Green Bay at that point. Following kickoff, I told you the pack would respond quickly. They did right here. Desmond Howard takes it at his one, takes a partial lick at the 30, and coast to coast, 99 yards, west to east, fill in your geography, and lights out on the Patriots. From there, a scoreless fourth quarter, and the clock winds down into a green and gold coronation. 35-21 the final. The new Packer coach remembered his predecessor. In this thing together, Coach Lombardi had a, had a wonderful legacy for the rest of us. And now we're just trying to do our part, and I hope we can do it for a long time to come. No one could be more disappointed than I am, because I do think we had a chance there for a moment. And, uh, you know, you never know what time, when this opportunity is going to come again. And the most valuable player, not far if not Reggie White, but return man Desmond Howard. He finds out right here on the big screen in the Superdome. 244 punt and kickoff return yards today. He's the first special teamer to be MVP in Super Bowl history. This for a man the Packers almost cut in the preseason. Before today, Howard's last big blip on the football radar screen, the 91 Heisman Award at Michigan. This is something you can't vote anyone into. You got to earn this. And this was earned today. And that's what they feel as though, okay, now you're getting your just due. You know, forget Hawaii, you're a world champ. Most other sports clearing out of the Super Bowl's path. Television, well, you know, the Lakers and Sonics played well before kickoff today in soggy Seattle. The Sonics and Lakes in a first place dead heat. That Shaq O'Neal, still rich, still young, and still talented. Probably drinking Pepsi to boot. The give and go slam off the spin, and the Lakes lead by as much as 21, but they gave it all back. Straight to crunch time, tie game. Kobe Bryant, the no Kobe, no Kobe, no Kobe. Uh, yes, Kobe. L.A. by a deuce. They're up by one. Milliseconds to go. Hersey Hawkins can win at the horn. No. And the Lakers win by one. They lead the Sonics by one in the West. And here's your scores on the flyby. And not on your schedule for tomorrow, Cal Poly and Hayward at Mott Gym Men's Basketball, 7 o'clock. Go there, be there. We'll have highlights tomorrow. All righty, Jake. Quite a day in Thanks. sports. Yes, I'd say Desmond Howard's going to Disneyland. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thanks, Thanks Jake. Jake.